Hi, welcome to Kali and the Gardener. Today it is the end of February and we are working on getting our garden ready for spring. Fall was cut short by a really fast winter and a lot of snow, so we didn't get the cleanup we were hoping for. But this is our chicken coop and we grow a lot of the plants that we feed the chickens with around their coop. Roses, different herbs, different flowers. And so you can see the roses and the herbs are still left in the ground, looking pretty sad. So we're gonna get those trimmed back. And when things start warming up, I'll pour compost around and we'll either reseed what didn't make it through this kind of harsh winter. And then in the back, we cut back a lot of sunflowers. I usually grow those every year. And so I'll come back, compost a lot of this, and we'll have a whole row of beautiful sunflowers that'll grow and we'll use those to feed the chickens. So everything around this awesome chicken coop is used to feed the chickens throughout the year. And the reason why we keep our chickens in a run, we live really close to the river. So we have a lot of large predators, hawks and eagles, as well as raccoons. And so these little girls would be snatched up if they weren't kept in a nice big run. But I also use them to take care of any bugs I have in the garden. I'll pull off any greens that look infected and they are happy little eaters of those. When my raspberry bushes get a little out of control, they take care of it very quickly if I just cut them back and throw them in. So they are my garden's happy helpers. And right now we have about 10 of them. And I'll definitely post an update once we get this area all cleaned up. You can see as we're cleaning up here, trying to get in end of February, do a little tidying up that we didn't get done in the fall. The weather's about to change. In Pacific Northwest, at least in 2023, it's been a little crazy here. So we're just getting in and out, doing as much as we can, even if it's just a few minutes and enjoying the sunshine.